Bonjour. Hello. Tago. My friends, we're here today. It's been a long time in the making. And we're creating a new tribe. Kings and little ones. We're the peacemakers. The peacemakers come together. It is time. You felt it in your heart. It's time to uh, it's time to join. Come together as a tribe. I'm here with my friend Mike. Mike. Nice to meet you. Today is a very special day. We won't keep you too long. But it is an honor today of a few people and millions of people. But we'd first like to identify who the first person we're sitting behind monument. This is in honor of my friend Leonard Rakuni Awa Alashnabe, who just recently passed away. I read how he read this document in my in his in my language after. But he left me his t-shirt, his sunglasses that I'm gonna wear, his hat, his walking stick, lots of fond memories while he we sat and ate in our storytelling house that he helped create and construct. He was a great friend. I love you, chum. Also, I'd like to give great honor to the following past and present. Noah Bokash, Auntie Levine, Levina, Joey Bokash, Nipissing First Nations, Mary Jane and Leon King from Christian Island, Barry Bomberry of Six Nations, Ray McIntyre of Thor Thorold, Ontario, Six Nations also, family, and family, Neil and Mary and Podash family and family, Hiawatha, First Nations, and my best friend, Mary Angela, Bokaj, and Ashnabe. We will read this document now. This earth, the earth, this earth is precious. I will speak it as Leonard spoke it in my tongue. In 1854, the great white chief in Washington made an offer for a large area of Indian land and promised a reservation for the Indian people. Chief Seattle's reply, published here in full, has been described as the most beautiful and profound statement on the environment ever made. We, uh, I will read it in my language, en français, the parts, and we will share this document together. You read the. No, I just. Uh, read you read this? No. Okay, start with this one and then I'll read all the sacred. How can you buy our land? How can you buy or sell the sky, the warmth of the land? The idea is strange to us. If we do not own the freshness of the air and the sparkle of the water, how can you buy them? Tout est sacré. Chaque partie de cette terre est sacrée. Chaque brillante épine de l'épinette, chaque plage sablonneuse, chaque brouillard dans les forêts sombres, chaque clairière et insecte bourdonnant est sacré dans la mémoire et expérience de mon peuple. La sève qui coule au travers des arbres transporte les mémoires de l'homme rouge. Les morts de l'homme blanc oublient le pays de leur naissance lorsqu'ils s'en vont marcher parmi les étoiles. Nos morts n'oublient jamais cette superbe planète car elle est la mère de l'homme rouge. Nous faisons partie de la terre et elle fait partie de nous. Les fleurs parfumées sont nos sœurs. Le chevreuil, le cheval, le grand aigle, ce sont nos frères. Les crêtes rocheuses, les fluides dans les prés, la chaleur du corps, du poney et de l'homme appartiennent tous à la même famille. All sacred. Every part of the earth is sacred to my people. Yeah, go for the next one. Oh. Not easy. Not easy. So when the great chief in Washington sends words that he wishes to buy our land, he asks much of us. The great chief sends words he will reserve us a place so that we can live comfortably to ourselves. He will be our father. We will be his children. So we will consider your offer to buy our land. He will be but it will not be easy, for this land is sacred to us. The shining water that moves in the streams and rivers is not just water, but the blood of our ancestors. If we sell you land, you must remember that it's sacred, and you must teach your children that, it's sac that it is sacred, and that each ghostly reflection in the clear water of the lakes tells 
of events and memories in the life of my people. The water's murmur is the voice of my father's father. Yeah. Kindness, or gentillesse, en français. Les rivières sont nos frères, ils apaisent notre soif. Les rivières transportent nos canaux et nourrissent nos enfants. Si nous vous vendons nos terres, vous devez vous souvenir et enseigner à vos enfants que les rivières sont nos frères et les vôtres et que vous devez donc donner la même gentillesse aux rivières que vous donnez à chacun de vos frères. Nous savons que l'homme blanc ne comprend pas nos façons de faire. Une portion de terrain est la même pour lui que la suivante. Car il est un étranger qui vient dans la nuit et prend de la terre tout ce qu'il a besoin. La terre n'est pas son frère, mais son ennemi. Et quand il l'a conquis, il passe au suivant. Il laisse la tombe de son père derrière et ça ne le dérange pas. Il kidnappe la terre de ses enfants et ça ne le dérange pas. La tombe de son père et le droit de ses enfants à leur naissance sont oubliés. Il traite sa mère, la terre, et son frère, le ciel, comme des choses qu'il a achetées, dépouillées, vendues, comme le mouton ou des perles brillantes. Son appétit va dévorer la terre et laisser derrière lui seulement un désert. Je ne sais pas. Nos façons de faire sont différentes des vôtres. La vue de vos cités fait mal aux yeux à l'homme rouge. Mais peut-être que c'est parce que l'homme rouge est un sauvage et ne comprend pas. Il n'y a pas d'endroit tranquille dans les cités de l'homme blanc. Pas d'endroit pour entendre le déploiement des feuilles au printemps ou le bruissement des ailes d'un insecte. Mais peut-être que c'est parce que je suis un sauvage et ne comprend pas. Le vacarme semble seulement insulter les oreilles. Et qu'y a-t-il à la vie si un homme ne peut pas entendre le cri solitaire de l'engoulevent ou les arguments des grenouilles autour d'un étang la nuit. Je suis l'homme rouge et je ne comprends pas. L'Indien préfère le son du vent s'élançant sur la face d'un étang et la senteur du vent lui-même, nettoyé par une pluie du midi ou parfumé par le pain pignon. Precious. Precious, the air is precious to the red man, for all things share the same breath. The beast, the tree, the man, they all share the same breath. The white man does not seem to notice the air he breathes. Like a man dying for many days, he is numb to the stench. But if we sell you our land, you must remember that the air is precious to us. The air shares its spirit with all life it supports the wind that gave our grandfather his first breath also receives his last sigh and if we sell you our land you must keep it apart and sacred as a place where even the white man can go to taste the wind that is sweetened by the meadow's flowers one condition une condition nous allons donc considérer votre offre d'acheter nos terres si nous décidons d'accepter je vais y mettre une condition. L'homme blanc doit traiter les bêtes de ses terres comme ses frères. Je suis un sauvage et je ne comprends aucune autre façon de faire. J'ai vu mille bœufs en décomposition dans les prairies, laissés par l'homme blanc qui les a tirés à partir d'un train passant. Je suis un sauvage et je ne comprends pas comment le cheval fumant en acier peut être plus important que le bœuf que nous tuons seulement pour rester en vie. Qu'est-ce que l'homme sans les bêtes? Si toutes les bêtes étaient parties, l'homme mourrait dans une grande solitude de l'esprit. Car n'importe que ce qu'il arrive aux bêtes, bientôt arrivera à l'homme. Toutes les choses sont connectées. All things are connected. Mais oui, the ashes. You must teach your children that the ground beneath their feet is the ashes of your grandfathers, so that they will respect the land. Tell your children the earth is rich with the lives of our kin. Teach your children, we have taught our children that the earth is our mother. 
Whatever befalls the earth befalls the sons of the earth. If men spit upon the ground, they spit upon themselves. This we know, the earth does not belong to man. Man belongs to the earth. This we know, all things are connected, like the blood which unites one family. All things are connected. Whatever befalls the earth befalls the sons of the earth. Man did not weave the web of life. He is merely a strand in it. Whatever he does to the web, he does to himself. Even the white man, whose God walks and talks with him as friend to friend, cannot be except them from the common destiny. We may be brothers after all, we shall see. One thing we know, which the white man may one day discover, our God is the same God. You may think now you might you may think now that you own him as you wish to own our land, but you cannot. He is the God of man, and his compassion is equal for the red man and the white. The earth is precious to him, and to harm the earth is to hemp contempt on its creator. The whites too shall pass, perhaps sooner than all tribes contaminate your bed and you will one night suffocate in your own waste but in your perishing you will shine brightly fired by the strength of god who brought you to the land and for some special purpose gave you dominion over this land and over the red man but in the perishing you will shine again that destiny is a mystery to us for we do not understand when the buffalo are all slaughtered the wild horse all tamed, the secret corners of the forest heavy with scent of many men, and the view of the ripe hills blotted by talking wires. Where is the thicket gone? Where is the eagle gone? The end of living and the beginning of survival. Brothers and sisters, we are standing here together because we are all connected. Like the great white chief said and we're standing together to honor the children the women the people all nations on this planet to honor creation to honor our planet our mother mother earth and to stand together and come together it's time for the peacemakers to come together because together we thrive together we prosper my friends, peace and love is all we can do. Love each other. Anagawe. Anagawe, in a good way. In a good way, Anagawe. And to the owl family, we specifically say thank you for creating a beautiful friend, Leonard Rakuni Owl, and a shnami, because he was a great man and he still is. His spirit lives here. You may come any time. He made this table for your family. He brought these rocks with Cecil Toulouse also. Thank you, merci beaucoup, and miigwech. Stay tuned. Next time, another video for you all. Miigwech. Pama